The influx of cheap imported goods from Asia has dampened the local manufacturing industry, leading to a major reduction in manufacturing activities in the country. Attempts by local producers to offer incentives on locally produced goods have not helped the situation. In the year 2010, retired President Mwai Kibaki directed all state departments to reserve 40% of their furniture budget to locally produced products. However, the directive fell hollow due to lack of a clear policy. This has seen the share of manufacturing to gross domestic products fall to around 10%. Last year, President Uhuru Kenyatta directed the Ministry of Industrialization to draft a policy on Buy Kenya, Build Kenya in order to spare the local manufacturing sector. Almost one year later, the ministry is yet to publish the policy which the Kenya Association of Manufacturers say is hurting the local producers. Trade and Industry Cabinet Secretary Eden Mohammed now says the policy is being finalized and will be published in two months' time. Late last year, the CAs admitted that more than 60% of materials used in the multi-billion shilling standard gauge railway project were imported, citing failure by local firms to meet the set standards. The World Bank has in the past urged Kenyan government to check the importation of cheap goods from China, which has won various contracts to develop infrastructure in the country.